In today's video, I'm gonna show you this really awesome fish eye transition right inside of Adobe Premiere Pro. So let's get right into it. So once you've got Adobe Premiere Pro open and you have a new sequence created and you've got two videos imported, you want to make sure they're both on video layer one and you want to make sure they're right next to each other. Now from here, select video layer one, we'll go into effects, into video effects, distort, and we'll search for lens distortion. Now we'll throw lens distortion onto the first video layer. And as you can see, if we pull the curvature over to the left or to the right, we've got this distortion effect happening and that looks really cool. But we'll pull that back down to zero. We'll pull the playhead to the very end of the first video clip. We'll create a brand new keyframe on the curvature by pressing the stopwatch icon. And then we'll go back in time, maybe five, six, seven keyframes and create a brand new keyframe. Now we'll go back to that first keyframe that we created at the very end of the clip and we'll pull the curvature all the way down to negative 100. Now from here, we'll move on to the second video clip. So we'll drag lens distortion onto the second video clip and we'll pull the curvature all the way down to negative 100 and create a brand new keyframe on the curvature at the very beginning of the clip. Move ahead in time, maybe six, seven, eight keyframes, and then we'll pull the curvature back down to 0%. And when we play this back, we've got this really fast lens distortion transition happening. So if you wanted to slow this down, all we would need to do is increase the gap between those two keyframes. So on the first video clip, we'll increase that gap. We'll go on to the second video clip. We'll increase the gap again. And there it is. It's really quick. It's really simple. And that is how you do the lens distortion, the fish eye transition right inside of Adobe Premiere Pro. And there you go. If you enjoyed watching this video, then please do let me know in that comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe check out the previous video and I will see you tomorrow for another brand new video. Thank you for watching.